We all deserve a reliable form of money, and GlimPay offers a convenient way to pay in gold with a card. And with me is the CEO of GlimPay, Jason Cousins. Welcome back. Thank you. See you again. Nice so to see you again too. Let's talk about because gold has got a lot of attention lately as inflation has gone up. Yeah. Crypto has gotten a lot of attention lately. Yeah. Why gold versus crypto? Well, I think we've got to get rid of this um, idea that for some reason uh, gold can't participate in electronic payments for the future and that crypto is the only solution. We've got to get rid of the idea that um, that you know somehow Bitcoin is going to replace gold, for instance, or you know we've got to we've got to choose one or the other. One's got to be dropped. Okay, so um, I mean, gold, of course, physical metal. Yeah. Uh, crypto is kind of all electronic. How does gold fit into the modern world? Well, glint has enabled physical gold to be used as money in electronic payments. We've enabled it to be able to enable our customers to be able to, with the Glint app and MasterCard, to be able to buy gold, save it, uh, spend it, send it, to receive it. It's, uh, we've made it participate in electronic payments. So we've given people effectively their own um, gold standard. Yeah, and you can move that money globally, right? Yeah. Like Just like you can Bitcoin or anything, Absolutely, really. you can send yeah. it from one app to another. Now, uh, gold has kind of, we know the U.S. You know, dropped the gold standard in the early 70s, um, right, 73, I think. 71, yeah. 71, okay. Yeah, but, but, you know, I think a lot of people misunderstand that as well. And, you know, uh, Nixon didn't uh, drop gold. He didn't come off the gold standard because he, uh, he, he didn't like gold. He came off the gold standard to protect the U.S. gold. You know, he... he uh, you know, at the time, um, many governments were exchanging their U.S. dollars for gold, mm -hmm. and so that's why he came off the gold standard because he valued it so much. He was losing. Fort Knox was going down in value. So, you know, the amount of gold in Fort Knox. Interesting. Yeah. And of course, it's kind of big. Some people say we should go back on the gold standard. Well, yeah. I mean, that's what Glint is doing for the world. Yeah. We're creating a bottom-up return to sound money, so everybody can have their own personal gold standard. Yeah. And you mentioned for the world. I mean, you're in how many countries? Yeah. Uh, we've got clients who've bought. You know, we, we, you can download the. Glint app in over 200 countries. Yeah. We've got the Glint card issued into people in the UK, across Europe, and in the US. So mm -hmm. that covers about 37 countries. So, what would be the main differences you would say between crypto and gold?
-hmm. And the cost of using gold as money, like what are the fees associated with it? It's gold? really, really cheap. There's no expensive transaction gas fees, for instance, mm -hmm. that you have with cryptocurrency. Really, yeah. it, it's only 0.5% when you buy gold or sell it. It's only 0.02% a month when you when you to store it and have it insured in, in a vault in, in, in Switzerland. Mm -hmm. um, and it's actually free to be able to receive or send gold and also spend it with the Glint card. Interesting. Um, so tell me about Glint. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I'm very familiar with it, yeah. but just give us a you know a, a debrief about it, and then also what's in the future. So um, with Glint, we're the first company in the world to enable gold, physical allocated gold, to you uh, to be able to participate in electronic payments. And with the Glint app and Mastercard, you can, as I said before, buy gold. Um, you can save it. You can um, receive it from other people. You can send it to people. You can spend it with the Glint Mastercard in real time anywhere in the world. And so we've we've made gold electronic. We've allowed, we've digitized it. We've enabled it to participate in electronic payments. And uh, effectively, what we're doing is building a gold-based alternative to banking, payments, and money. And we have the opportunity and the capability now to build a global gold-based um, financial ecosystem mm -hmm. um, based on gold. Yeah, and it works. I've seen it work. Yeah. You were out at lunch and you used gold to I pay did, for yeah. lunch. I did, yeah. I used so. it to pay for my hotel last night, yeah. my flight. <laughs> I use it all the time, and so do a lot of our customers. And it's just like a credit card, and the retailer does not know it, the difference, right? No, it's a, I mean, it's a debit card. There's no debit credit. Card, right. Within the Glint system, mm -hmm. and um, yeah, our, our customers uh, save in gold, and when they spend, uh, the, the, the merchant has no idea mm -hmm. um, that we're paying with gold. Uh, but maybe in the future, they'll have a Glint account too, and yeah. they'll price their products. In gold <laughs> it's really fascinating technology. So thank you so much, Jason. Thank you. Yep.